It's a problem that people are ashamed of acknowledging. It's very humiliating. It's tiring. What are we going to do? The only reason hunger isn't fixed yet in this country is because the American people haven't spoken. This generation will live sicker and die younger than their parents' generation. Hunger is right here in the United States. And the problem is getting worse. Jeff Bridges is in this film because Jeff Bridges called us and said, I need to be a part of this film. What I'm hoping is that maybe that increase in the problem is part of the solution, that that's going to finally wake people up to how, you know, what dire straits we're in here with this. And the good news in this case is that we can fix this. The reason people are going hungry is not because of a shortage of food, it's because of poverty. Ironically, we're producing more food than ever before, and yet more and more people are going hungry. And so again, it's this food system that we have that's, that's really broken. One out of every two kids in the United States at some point will be on food assistance. There is hunger or food insecurity in every single county in the United States, which is kind of stunning when you think about it. And if there's an issue that impacts every single county in this country, then every single citizen in this country has a stake in fixing it. I was one of those kids that was hungry. It messes with you. The average food stamp benefit was $3 a day. There are people who are living on that, and you really can't. The term food insecure really encompasses what, what millions and millions of Americans experience every day, and that is not knowing where your next meal is going to come from. If you have a limited amount of money, you're going to spend it on the cheapest calories you can get, and that's processed food. It's kind of ridiculous that a fast food hamburger costs less money than a peach when kids are eating poor and poorly nutritious food, fast food, they're getting a lot of calories, but they're getting empty calories, and so they're always hungry. As many as 50 million Americans rely on charitable food programs. I haven't received a pay raise in four years, and what I used to spend on a month in groceries now gets me about two weeks. In this country, we tend to blame people for their problems. We tend to make them feel like they're somehow responsible or they've failed. Sometimes we run out of food. We get really hungry, and our tummies just growl. And if 50 million people are struggling with something, well, then those of us who aren't struggling are impacted, whether we realize it or not. It's about patriotism, really. If another country was doing this to our kids, we would be at war. And it doesn't have to be that way. What do you believe our nation stands for? And do you think it's OK that there are that many children going to bed hungry? This isn't a complicated issue. We have enough food. We know where people are that are hungry. Just, just feed them. It's so good. A Place at the Table. Watch it now on iTunes.